Hey, you want to forget about the scarf, Marv? Let's go in through this door here. For those that didn't get it, my name's Chris. I'm from Six Winds. What's your name? Sup, Brick Kid! Uh, no, my name's Matt, but Marv, Marv says that. It's one of my favorite lines in Home Alone 2. Uh, yeah, uh, my name's Matt. Oh, cool. Well, we're here to talk about a uh, matchup of Leonardo DiCaprio, who was the number one seed, and surprise, surprise, it's not Daniel Stern. He didn't make it on here, unfortunately. <sighs> no! Maybe, yeah. maybe funniest person, but uh, maybe, yeah. Leonardo DiCaprio, number one seed, Versus the number eight, Joe Pesci, who, this is a second round matchup. Now, Joe Pesci advanced against Steve Buscemi, and that was a good matchup. We got a lot of people like, this is a great matchup. They both had kind of similar roles, but like, find me one person that doesn't like Steve Buscemi, and I'll find you a, a liar, pal. Uh, <laughs> but, um, you know, Leo's going to be a tough match for Joe Pesci, no, really, no matter who you are. But do you yeah. want to kick it off with your thoughts on Leo Pesci? Yeah, we also, when we talked about Buscemi Pesci, we kind of went back and forth in our own thoughts on, like, who we would take and, and things like that. But it was it was kind of just, like, <clears throat> whoever wins this, you're feeding them to Leo. Like, I, there are people in the second round, you know, maybe seated around, like, 6 to 10 that mm -hmm. might be able to hang with Leo. Mm -hmm. But, like, Pesci and Buscemi, I just don't think, like, one, popularity, even though it's not really supposed to be a factor. Mm -hmm. But two, like, Leo's just in more popular movies. And so his performances are going to be seen by more people who are going to think he's a better actor because mm -hmm. they did see one really good performance. Or sometimes, like, yeah, we've seen Joe Pesci. Like, everybody's probably seen Home Alone. And you've mm -hmm. seen Joe Pesci in it. But nobody's going to be like, yeah, that guy's a really good actor. Like, right. they just, you like the Home Alone movies. So you have to dig around to find, like, how good of an actor is Joe Pesci and really mm -hmm. have to, like, see movies that aren't as ubiquitous? So, you know, I I figured Leo was going to win. I would also vote for Leo, even though I personally think Leo is a bit overrated. Mm -hmm. I will say it. Mm -hmm. um, a one seat, I think, is fine and fair, but I just, like, subjective. My own personal opinion, for sure. I, I don't think his acting is that tremendous. Mm -hmm. Um... But yeah, so th those those are my thoughts there. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, I put you know Leo. I think deserves the one seed. I think he's just you know he's the kind of actor that like you could build a whole movie around him. You know, um, he's just been the top drawer, like you know the star of so many movies, and you know banger after banger after banger from like. Was it Catch Me If You Can, mm -hmm. Inception, Shutter Island, like all these like really good movies in like kind of mid two thousands, and it was like he was scratching and clawing and fighting for that uh, that Oscar yeah, that Oscar. he finally got with The Revenant. <laughs> but anyways, I actually Leo said good evening to me one time at uh, at republic restaurant it was one of the coolest moments of my life and all he said was good evening um but uh but yeah and i want to address one thing okay the door you know the, what i'm talking about titanic titanic in the, door in the door oh and everyone who says hey rose you could have fit leo on there you selfish bitch <laughs> And there's this whole thing, and I've always said, did you watch the movie? Did you see how many times they tried? Mm. She tried shifting, he tried getting on, and the door kept tipping over. And I think they brought this to science, and I don't know if it was Mythbusters or, or a similar show yeah. or YouTube show, whatever. And they tried, and just weight and buoyancy, and you can't do it. Literally. Now, I will say... With someone small enough as Joe Pesci, oh. you probably could finagle a way to, like, stack one on top of the yeah. other. You know, if you do, like, you know, butt to mouth. And so what just... you're saying is, had they cast Joe Pesci in Titanic, we would have had a happy ending. I think 
think we would have had a happy ending. I think we would have had a better movie too. <laughs> no, she's great. Uh, Rose, whoever played. Wait, Rose. were you saying we would cast Joe Pesci instead of Rose or instead of Leo? Instead of Rose. <laughs> so Leo and Joe Pesci are on the door together. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think they made a much. No, better... that. It was not the switch I was picturing, but that almost makes it better. Yeah, could you picture like Leo's drawing Joe Pesci on the couch with like? Paint me as one of your French girls. That's a terrible Joe Pesci. I'm. <laughs> Yeah, hurry it up! I got a place to be. What am I, a funny guy to you? Let's go dancing. I'll stand up on my tail. Hey, hey, I'm Joe Pesci. Watch me stand up on my tiptoes. The movie needs to be made immediately. Like a cut, an edit of like Joe Pesci superimposed over uh, Kate Winslet in the Titanic. Book it, Vince. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Do it, Hollywood. Uh, but no, no surprise. Who's moving on? Leo is moving on. Yeah, so Leo's got his second win. It's going to get more interesting because the guys he could face in the next round and then in the matchup to go to the final four are some really heavy hitters. So we'll be getting to those down the line. Uh, and we'll see if Leo is going to still be a favorite. Yeah, I think just, just to close on this, I think this region, we call it the Leo region. Yeah. Um... In terms of first round matchups, I was least excited yeah, about it. Yeah, I remember that. But now, seeing how it's unfolding and seeing what could be in like the Sweet 16, even Elite Eight, it's one of my favorite brackets. Oh, yeah, it's like, it's juicy. one of my favorite regions of the bracket. It for so. sure is. Yeah. Yeah.